Uh, reward your efforts of trying to catch that sneaky leprechaun with this dessert. Lindy Davis back on the show yes. to share her recipe for no bake shamrock cheesecakes. So good. So You're do gonna you love it. celebrate St. Patty's Day at your house? Yes, we do. Okay. Okay. Uh, the the leprechaun. He's sneaky. He's a sneaky leprechaun. We don't set traps, but he, the leprechaun is really nice and likes to. Uh, make a mess and give little gifts and put green everywhere. You just and let him do his thing. Just let him do his thing. Yeah. So yes, he came to our house this morning. Okay. So we did. We had the le le the lucky leprechaun come to our house. And then you do this special treat. And then we do on special treat. Patty's Day. Yes. And I love that it's no bake. And it's gonna be green. Everything is green except for the corned beef and ca well, the cabbage is green. But you know, except for the corned beef, everything else is gonna Has be green. Has to have that theme today. Has to have green. Okay, Lindy, how do we yes. put this together? Okay, it's so simple. What you're gonna do is you're gonna grab one and a half bars of cream cheese. Okay. Okay, put it in a bowl, mm -hmm. and you're gonna mix it with four tablespoons of sugar. Alrighty. Let's just mix that mix up that real up. So quick. One, it softens so that yes. that all incorporates and yes. comes together. And it's actually a lot easier to make if you like take it out of the fridge, let it sit a little bit, make sure it is softened, and that will be a lot more smoother and a lot less lumps as you can see that I we're know, having already. I know because it always just kind of sticks it on the beers. It just sticks together. Mm -hmm. it is, but yes, let it soften. Okay. Okay, and then what you're going to do is you're going to add, because you got to have peppermint flavor. Right? It's oh, gotta be it's gotta taste delicious. Because when you see the green, when you, you see actually the green, expect you think, the peppermint. Yes. Mm -hmm. So cute little peppermint. My friend's mom made this. So thank you, Mandy. Your mom is on TV Mandy, today. Mandy, you're contributing thank to our you. recipe on the show. Okay, yes. pour you that can do in a there. fourth or a half a teaspoon, and it makes it delicious. Just makes however it much up. you like. Yes. Okay. And then the fun part is is putting in the green dye. So this is what my kids love to do because of course they make a mess, but then they make it green and they get to see how it turns out. No, I was out. thinking about your little five-year-old, and I'm sure. <laughs> There would be some extra there's green. Always, there's a lot of green. Extra if he pours it in, in oh, there's a lot. And you, he loves it. But that's just going to make it that pretty color. Yes. So here we go. in our cheesecake. We're going to mix it together. Make okay. it as green or as light as green as you want. And then the, we're going to make chill this. So after you mix it up, we're going to put it in the fridge mm -hmm. for at least 30, to a, 30 minutes to an hour. Okay. Okay. So here we go. So this has a couple steps. Couple of steps. Mm -hmm. So while it's getting chilled in the fridge, you're going to take some Oreos, and of course it's got to be double stuffed because that's the best, right? Like stuff the best. Got to be double stuffed. Yeah. Double stuffed. Take it up. Okay. For my family, we have a family of four, so we use about 20 Oreos. Okay. But we don't need to do 20 Oreos. How many right should now. we do in here? Just do whatever you want. Just okay. Put it in, and then this again is another part where you can get your kids involved and just that's fine. Oh, that's fine. Oh, that's, that's plenty all. for oh, now. Okay. Oh yeah. And then put it together. Use the spoon and just let them smash. Just smash. Just smash okay. it. Up. Or you pieces. can do if you want to release some stress and you just want to smash it. Go ahead. I had a long day of birthday celebration <laughs> that's, yesterday that's right. in my just, house. Yes, yeah, smash it. <laughs> when, I'm, when I'm getting a text from my from my son's teacher, what did he do that's today? That's you smash <laughs> some Oreos. Yes. Okay. All right. Smash some Oreos. So we've got okay. those. We got it together. Or you could get your little, you know, Cuisinart grinder and make it super small like that. So mm -hmm. depending if you want like some chunks or super small like sand, you could do either or. So what we're gonna do is you're gonna grab a couple of cups. So we're ready to put it together now. We're gonna put it together. First, let me get the cold stuff. Okay. So you start doing that. Get the Oreos. So I'm going to the fridge. Oreos go on the bottom. Oreos are on so the bottom. So we'll scoop on the bottom. Yes. Okay. And I will give you and some too. And you can do too. as high as you want or as low as you want. Okay. We love Oreos. So the more the better. So you for like us. a little bit more. Okay. Let me we put do. more in yours. Perfect. And see, it's nice and chilled. Oh, see, yeah, Beautiful it comes green. together. Like it, it, the consistency is different when it's chilled. I totally forgot something really important. What did you forget? <laughs> You're cracking me up. But cool Whip, guys, you gotta put Cool Whip back in this recipe. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was gonna say this looks different than this does. <laughs> You're gonna add a cup to this, okay? You're gonna mix this together. I think this there are no important. mistakes with a no this bake is, cheesecake. No. This Very is important. important. Okay. All right. Cool up is important. So there is cool up There's in cool here. up in here. We got a minute. Let's put it together. <laughs> There's always something. Right? I could see that Houston, was we difference. had a problem. Houston, but I we didn't have, know what it was. You should have told me. You're like, uh, <laughs> okay. isn't there something so else? A dollop there. A dollop there. Now what? Okay, now we either add more Cool Whip or whipped cream, whatever one you like the best. I think we add 
a little Dollop. on mine too. Okay, let's do Dollop this one. That, dollop that in there. Dollop it up. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, and here's the fun part. Put some little chocolate chips. Okay. Get some fun marshmallows. We got like rainbow marshmallows Sprinkle over me. here. Sprinkle me. Go over there. If you want to undo the chocolate coin, put the chocolate coin okay, on so top. Okay, so we put one of those in there, one of these in there. Yes. And then, you and then wrap the chocolate coin. Unwrap the coin. Okay, because okay. this is a favorite at our house. The coins are, are magical. They're magically delicious, well, because right? it's one time a year, right? Yes. This is that time of year you get these. So then put it on top, and voila! And you have a fun little snack treat. Look how cute those are. And easy, delicious, simple. Okay, Just Lindy, your cool Instagram whip. is? <laughs> Lindy underscore Davies. And the recipe is at abc4.com slash GTU. Happy St. Patty's Happy Day, St. my Patrick's. friend. <laughs> my friend, I'm having fun. We, we always have fun.